the next the next series that I'm exploring will be called The Little Ant That Can't. And we're going to be talking about these little ants, and I'm calling them little ants, but they are dusties, ashies, you know, the types that try to move into your home and eat your food, use your Wi-Fi, and get your Hulu passwords. We're going to be talking about these people and how to avoid them. And what I want to do, you guys go ahead, drop your comments, drop your story times into the comment section, and we will continue to explore these types so that the next woman can see these red flags. Now, from the words of a little ant, he was on these social media streets giving the game to guys on how they can get fed and how they could use this woman's um, sofa and her nice warm water. This is what he says. Um, you know, because using, yeah, using these tactics, this is how they get homes. So this is what he says. Number one, and I took notes. I'm not sharing him. He took, I took notes. You have to go to her house first. That is the key. You have to go to her house. Um, like after the date or whatever, if you, they have to get a couple of dollars for the initial date, but you got to make sure she has a home to go to. And then after that, and you have to do this the night before she goes to work and she has to have a, um, an early day. So you have to know, number one, that she has a home, number two, that she has a job, and then number three, that you're going to be going on a date the night before she has to go to work. So then the third step is to make such passionate love in her home, in her bed. You're like doing this for survival. You, you, This man, ha this aunt, has to give her such shivers that she is perfectly fine. She loses her brain to the point that she is willing to go to work and leave him in the house. So number four, if she leaves for work um, without making you leave, you just stay. Stay in the house. Stay in her home. Don't leave. Stay there. Like this is now your home. You're planting your flag. Number five, have the dishes cleaned and food made when she comes home. Like, make yourself seem useful. Don't seem like the, the parasite or energy vampire or resource vampire that you are trying to be. Number six, if she leaves and you need clothes, leave the door unlocked and just run and get what you need and um, be as quick as you can while she's at work. So, this is the... This, this is the game that this little ant gave to his other fellow people that are looking for a place to stay. And we are going to combat that. We are going to be like, no, all of these red flags, it is so good that they are putting their red flags and their dysfunction on display on social media. So we can take their, their words and step by step work to dismantle or work to prep the next generation of women on how we are not going to be fooled into this. I'm going to come back to this list um, so that we can continue to talk about it because we have got to deprogram. These people have had game for years and we as women and girls have always been told, keep your head in them books. Don't worry about them boys, but they've been giving game to each other forever. They've been giving game. We have not been prepared and we are going to change that. We're going to change that with this series. Just say no to little ants, little ants that can't, little ants that can't. This is going to be the series. We're going to be talking about these red flags. We're going to role play on how you're going to avoid these people, what they say to you, um, and then what you can do basically run run and block that's going to be the the gist of it but run block don't entertain these people don't let them know you have a job don't let them know that you're a nurse don't let them know that you have a bank account don't tell them nothing <laughs> all right you guys go ahead like i said this is the initial this is the jump off series the little ant that can't be looking for it drop your comments drop your story times and let's get this going